this is my friend Metal Mike. Say hello, Metal Mike. Hello. Now, he's going to help us to read some words because he always talks in robot talk. So you can help us by doing some reading and help us to find out what Metal Mike is saying. I'm a little metal robot, you can see me walk. I use special sounds to make me talk. Listen to me speaking, sounding out the word yuck. Now can you say the word you heard? Yuck. Yuck. Which of those words do you think Metal Mike was saying? Yuck. Yuck! Did you get it right? <laughs> oh, we liked that. I'm a little metal robot. You can see me walk. I use special sounds to make me talk. Listen to me speaking, sounding out the word zip. Now, can you say the word you heard? Zip. Which of those words do you think he's saying? Z Zip. Zip. Did you get it right? <laughs> I'm a little metal robot. You can see me walk. I use special sounds to make me talk. Listen to me speaking, sounding out the word yes. Now, can you say the word you heard? Yes. Yes. Which of those do you think he's saying? Yes! Well done! Did you get it right? Uh, oh, he did a burp. How rude. Okay, we've got three left, so I'm going to say the sounds like a robot and see if you can tell me which ones he is saying. Y -e -l. Y -e -l. Yell! Did you get that one right? Two more. Come on, Metal Mike, you do another one for us. Z it. Z it. Which of those two words do you think he's saying? Zit. Well done, like when you have a big spot. <clears throat> okay, the last one ready. I bet you can say this like a robot at home as well. Y -a -m. Yum. Yum, yum. <clears throat> Did you like that? Yeah, ah, mm, yum. Well done, Metal Mike. And you at home, you did a great job, didn't you? Well, because we've been so good at doing our robot talk, we can have a go at writing those words. So I'm just going to check that my pen works here. And I told you about the big spot. What did we say the big spot was? A zit. Can we say zit like a robot? You can even use your robot arms. Z -i What's the first sound? Z it. It's the z. z. What's the middle sound in zit? Z i i i i i. Z i z i. What's the last sound in zit? Zit zit. It's the t t t t t t t sound. Now maybe at home your grown-ups might even draw a little phoneme frame like this with three boxes so you can have a go at writing this word a zip like when you zip your coat up so what sounds can you hear in zip can you say zip like a robot Z -i -p. zip have a go at home as well and then you can check if you're right Z -i -p. zip Give yourself a big clap if you've got those right. Zit, zip. Now the last thing that I was going to ask you to do, it is a super challenge because we are going to apply everything that we have learned so far to read a whole sentence. Now there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine words in this sentence. That's a very long sentence. We know this tricky word here, don't we? We know this one. It's our tricky word from phase two, isn't it? It says, it's got capital letters, that's the beginning of the sentence. The, b, 
a g bag. Oh, I can see a bag down there. I'm going to use the picture as a clue to help me as well. The bag, let's sound this one out, has, has, the bag has g -ot got, I'm going to go back to the beginning of the sentence to help me, the bag has got a, oh, there is a word missing. Now I can look at this shape to help me think about what that word could be. Oh, that letter looks like it might come down a little bit. The bag has got a on the b a k back. What do you think it could be? Tell your grown up at home. Have a look at the picture. Zip. Zip. Let's see if that makes sense because sentences have to make sense. Oh, that fits, doesn't it? Shall we read it together? The bag has got a zip on the back. Full stop.